Hi, my name is Susan Carlson, and I live in Harpswell, Maine, which is just kind of along the southern coast of Maine. And it's fantastic to be here. It's my first time at a Paducah show, and it's extra special to be here with um, my 12 quilts here. And I do have one quilt in the general show, um, a portrait of my niece, Maya, sprouting monarch butterfly wings. Okay, so this quilt is named Crocodilus Smilus, but I've nicknamed her Stevie. She's a Australian saltwater crocodile, which is the largest living reptile in the world. And that's a pretty cool fact that I learned when my son was about three or four years old and I was reading him nature encyclopedias. And you don't really realize how um, big a um, average 20 foot crocodile means until you actually take that tape measure and measure it out. So I thought that was a pretty awesome fact and I wanted to show other people like you guys <laughs> um, how awesome it is to have a, um, a creature this size that actually exists in our world. CV um, is made up of a lot of different fabrics, so it's a fabric collage and it's uh, one um, image that is filled in with probably thousands of pieces of fabric. And some of the fabrics that I've used are Australian Aboriginal print fabrics, which is the part of the world that she's from. Also lots of batiks I use and um, some very special hand painted or hand stamped fabrics that I've picked up in my travels. She is filled with a few, um, or rather I should say, she contains a few of the Australian animals that she um, lives with. And I figure she's a top predator, and so she probably in real life has a few of those animals in her already anyway. Um, so I'll point out a few of those. There is a snake up here, so there's a snake print right there and these are all the Australian Aboriginal print fabrics that I've used so they're kind of authentic to you know um, that part of the world. Uh, there's emus up here. You'll, there's a few emus kind of going along her back spine. There's a lizard right there in her belly. Uh, there are witchetty grubs. So there's these little like kind of marshmallow like looking um, kind of caterpillars, grubs. So those are witchetty grubs, they're called. And then over here on her tail, um, there are a few different types of um, kangaroos. 